welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know I haven't been uploading in a while, and there's a pretty good reason for it. I felt like the videos have been getting very repetitive and boring, and it's been pretty difficult finding new water brands to test. So now I've decided to change the channel up a little bit, especially with the face reveal and all. But in today's video, I'm gonna go to the supermarket, get a Red Bull and an alkaline water brand, and go back home to test it. So, let's go. Okay, now that we're in the store, we need to find the water bottle section to get the Red Bull and the water. I'm pretty sure it's over here. Okay, now I found where the Red Bull is. Now we need to decide. Which flavors do we want to use for the experiment? I think we should go with the sugar-free version. And just since it's summer, I'm going to go with the green summer edition too. Now we need to find the alkaline water. And I'm not sure which one of these is alkaline. So I might just take one of these. But I'm going to need to put the camera down to be able to carry it. So, one sec guys from the supermarket, let's begin testing the waters. For the first experiment, we're going to pour a little bit of each thing into the bottle, I mean the cup. This much should be enough for each. Okay, now let's take the pH drops, open them up, and begin testing. This got a bit darker. This one still hasn't mixed yet. But I'm probably going to need to get a straw to mix this up. Okay. Here's our straw and let's take it out so we can stir it a little. This turned like to a dark orange. I remember it being like a light yellow in the beginning. This one's more of a green, but I think since I took it out from this one, the color kind of mixed, which isn't good. Okay, now that we mixed all the stuff, we can say that this one, it's very acidic because it's nearly the same color as on the bottle this one is in the middle but still acidic it's almost neutral but i consider it a bit more yellow and this one the same as the first red bull it's pretty dark now the next part of the test we need to take the water and pour a good amount of it into each bottle or cup This part of the test is to show that even though we put so much water into the cup, the color nearly didn't change at all. The same for this one. And now, the last part of the test, we need to take the Red Bull and put a few drops into this one and see if the color changes. We did a little bit and the color doesn't seem to have changed much, but it got a lot darker. Now it's almost orange, but it's still light. Let's put a couple more drops and see if it changes. It did change quite a bit. Now it's near a 4 to a 5, which is much more acidic than at the beginning. Well, that concludes our test. Hope you enjoyed the video, and comment down below which video you would like to see next.